ask we investigate, we want to warn you, the pictures you are about to see are graphic. A Shawano woman asking for help after she finds animal heads decomposing next to her house. The neighbor says the steer heads come from Pingle's meat shop, and the shop says they were just trying to help a customer. NBC 26's Cassandra Duval has more on the story. Stacey, here are pages of complaints from the Shawano Police Department. They say they've received four complaints in the last calendar year in regards to Pingles, mainly from odor coming from the dumpsters. But for one family, seeing dead animal heads was the last straw. It's like something died in your backyard and you just left it there. Catherine Dove says what she saw about 150 feet from her house this week was shocking. I looked closer and there were heads that were decomposing with the fur and the skin and everything still on and the eyeballs still in and they were, it was like rotting. She says this isn't the first time she's had a problem with Pingle's meat shop, taking her complaints to police last summer for odor as well. The diseases and bacteria and who knows what's on these things. But the co-owner of Pingle says this is just an unhappy neighbor, and the shop was saving the Longhorns for a customer who wanted them back. We will continue to provide quality products, quality service to our customers. Pingles invited us in this afternoon for a tour. They said the heads were cleaned up and there will not be any future animal heads placed in their backyard. Let us do our business as we have properly done for years. Four complaints in a year, and not just from Dove. Shano police say each time there's been a call, Pingles has cooperated and taken care of the problem. In all ordinance enforcement, there's a balancing act. Okay, so we try to balance the facts that we gather through an investigation. Dove says she feels better after the cleanup. As long as it's all gone, it's over. Police explain if there are future problems that move to citations, they will notify the health department. And we called the Shawano County Health Department today. The director says they haven't received any referrals from Pingles from police, but if they do in the future, they would look into ordinances and regulations for proper meat disposal. Cassandra Duval, NBC 26.